Hi, this is Sector Readings by Andre, where I do predictions of the future. If you'd like me to do prediction for you, let me know in the comments below. Hi everyone, it's time to talk about Dense Coin, that cell phone platform that everybody's pretty razzed about. I do see it going up to a dollar within the next two years, but in that two years time, it's gonna have a lot of problems being pushed on by other companies that are trying to do the same thing or already in that space, Verizon, Rogers, uh, that sort of thing, to go forward with their system. But I do see a bit of a change around as more and more people use cryptocurrencies with that changeover from the old system to the new system. So it makes sense that everybody would be using a cryptocurrency for their cell phone needs. Um, but with that, there's going to be a lot of hang-ups with the other companies trying to enforce their ideas on the way it should be. So, I do see a lot of the other companies that are already existing going to cryptocurrency and going along with the Federal Reserve idea of the new rollout coming out in the next two years. But I do still see it going to a dollar in the next two years. Even with all that wonderful stuff, still going to a dollar. For whatever reason, I guess they tame that, that uh, lion and actually make great gains going forward. But it, overall coverage of the plan, I think they're going to be making some side deals with the existing companies as that's something they're going to have to do. I don't see this coin being part of the Federal Reserve. At least it didn't come up as being part of the Federal Reserve idea, but it may down the couple of years time. Okay. So it's going to be rough going, but it, it, it will, it will prevail even with all those hardships. Hopefully this answers your question on dent coin. Somebody in my comments below asked about hollow fuel, which is part of the hollow coin uh, platform. Um, Will it reach a dollar this year? And I checked and I checked. No, not this year, but it de definitely will go to a dollar in price in 2021. And that's, uh, I checked it a couple times and yes, it will achieve that. It's part of the reasons that it probably won't go up as quickly this year is because there's some shenanigans behind the scenes on their team uh, which is going to be affecting the project as a whole. Uh, so there's going to be a part of the, the team that's going to be wanting something else and of course you have the the opposed team. Uh, this one is up to some monkey business this one it wants to stay on track to what they had originally planned. And a part of that is because it's going to be part of the Federal Reserve. And that's going to be a bit of a disruptor going forward as the team will probably s split up that's coming up in the cards, which will cause a lot of headaches for this team going forward, trying to make new uh, deals with the new partners coming on board and getting rid of people of this team, okay? There's gonna be some legal things coming <laughs> around, I think this team, um, for some of the things that they're doing. Just a warning for these people trying to change the status quo, uh, especially when you're dealing with very powerful people, uh, probably not a good idea. <laughs> it probably lead to um, not working in the industry 
or running away and actually attaching yourself to another uh, platform. Uh, outside of that, the melding of the two, the Federal Reserve and this, the platform is going to be a great mix. It's going to work out very, very well and it's going to be working as the Federal Reserve change starts to slowly or quickly, depending on your viewpoint, uh, changing everything over to the new system. Okay, hopefully this answers your question. So, Hall of Fuel, one dollar and twenty twenty one. Hi, somebody was asking if I do another video on V Chain. As everybody or some of you <laughs> remember, I did a video on V Chain not that long ago, and a lot of people didn't like the results, even though it was mostly positive for V Chain. Nothing wrong with the team. Nothing wrong with the technology. It's going to be very important technology going forward. I was talking about the partnerships that they're trying to build, okay, which were falling away. Now it makes sense when I do another reading and with the knowledge of the Federal Reserve switching everything over to the new system from the old. That partnership I was referring to in the last video was that Federal Reserve. Like most coins, they're very hesitant on joining on with the Federal Reserve and the banking cartel. Rightly so. And this is where the problems stem. Okay? <laughs> Not that I hate that coin and all that. I don't, I don't like Federal Reserve, but I do like feed chain. Just get that out there. Okay? So there's going to be a moment in time when they're very resistant to the, the banking cartels wanting to join with this project, the V-Chain project. It's going to take some time. It's going to maybe a year or two until they go, okay, we'll be a partner with you and the banking cartel. When that happens, the price is probably going to jump up to a dollar. I do see it within the next two years of a dollar per coin. And that's Canadian. Whatever that is in American, you can figure it out from here. Once they do, the partnerships, all those old partnerships that fell away will come back. Okay? That's just how big money works. Right? They want what they want, what they want. It's the facts of life. But with that, it leaves a bad taste in your mouth, as will the team. I'll have that ill feeling in the stomach. But it'll be fine. It'll last that 10 years. The technology's fantastic, and it's a good team. Okay? Hopefully this answers your questions on VChain. I'm always thankful for the people that are donating down below. Remember to get your 15 to 35% off Amazon purchases also down below. Remember to check out my new Patreon page. And remember to like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the future.